Hi, I'm Ethan Walbrink with Van Meter Solar, and I'm going to show you today a couple of tips about using a Hoy Miles 2 to 1 microinverter versus a 4 to 1 microinverter, and specifically where to lay them out or placement so you get the most efficient and effective use of that device. All right, so here we've got a 4 to 1 microinverter. And I've got some white lines on here just so you can see exactly where our modules are going to be placed. Everybody in the business is used to using a one-to-one -one device and there's really no thinking involved with that, right? You're just going to put one device, optimizer, micro, whatever that MLPE is, under each module and you'll kind of center it there or you'll mount it to the module itself. In this scenario, we've got to get a little more strategic. We're going to start with the four-to-one, which is sometimes understood to be more complex, but I think we can show you how it doesn't have to be that. So we're gonna take this four to one device and we're gonna mount it all the way to the right side of module number two. And we're gonna make sure these leads are sticking out from underneath the module. The reason for that, as you'll see when we go to lay these on, is so we'll mount and plug in module number one, mount and plug in module number two, and once module number two is mounted, we're gonna cover the device, but we're still gonna have access to these leads. That's the, that's the important part. And then you'll see what we'll do that's untraditional is we're actually gonna lay number four before number three, and that's for obvious reasons, so we have access to those plugs. So watch and we'll show you how. All right, so just to note, the way we place that, that's what we believe is the best way to install a four to one when you've got four wide, one high in portrait. That's the worst possible configuration to use a four to one. And remember this, when we laid module number one and when we, we laid module number four, the only way you can get factory leads to reach that distance is if you use the products that we have I know not of any modules that are available with stock 2400 millimeter leads. We've customized our modules that way for this purpose. You could make jumpers and you could add it to a different product, but you specifically, we have products that are designed, these modules are designed to do this in a very efficient way. And that's what we've demonstrated for you. All right, so here we are. We just rearranged the same system, only with two to one devices instead of four to one and it doesn't get much simpler than this. You're just always gonna put the device in the center of your second module. So this one's under module number two, this one's under module number four. So you'll lay module number one, plug it in, manage your wires, lay module number two, plug it in, manage your wires, lay it down, number three, number four, and you see how that can continue on and it's very, very simple. So that wraps up our tips on layouts of two to one micros, four to one micros. Again, these are Hoy Miles HM series. Um, and the biggest reason why we wanted to show this is because if you were to use a one to one device here, you're gonna have four devices, you're gonna have four AC connections, you're gonna buy more bus cable. But if you use two to ones, now you cut that number in half. If you use four to ones, now you cut that number down to 25% of what it would have been. So there's an immense amount of cost savings. There's an immense amount of O&M reduction. 
that we believe can be found when you use multiple MLPE as opposed to just one, and we wanted to show you how easy it is to do that. Step it on the module, watch out. <laughs> that one doesn't break. <laughs>